When I planned out my cat tree, I knew I wanted to make a hammock accessory to go along with it. It was a second mini project to accompany the tree, but my cat loves it and it was totally worth the time. Let me show you what I did. I started by cutting out all of my fabric and pinning the fluffier pillow fabric to the center of the hammock on three of the four sides, curling the ends under so that nothing would unravel. You can find the exact dimensions I used in the blog post that's linked in the description below. Then I cut squares out from each corner of the fabric. This is so that I can ultimately sew the four sides together and create an enclosed drop area for my cat to relax. Finally, I pinned each of the loose sides of the hammock so that the ends wouldn't unravel. Then it was time to sew. I sewed three of the four pillow sides, leaving one side open to add pillow fluff to later. I also sewed the hems I created on the sides of the hammock. Then I stuffed the pillows with fluff. Fun fact, I don't actually buy polyfill for this, but instead get 50 cent pillows at my local thrift store and take the fluff out of them. It's way cheaper and equally comfy. Then I pinned the fourth side down and sewed it in place. Next I worked on the corners. I started by aligning and pinning adjoining corners right sides together. Just to be clear, I did all four corners at the same time. Then I sewed the corners together. This stitch is just a normal line stitch like any other stitch. Don't get freaked out by it. Finally, I added a grommet to each corner. Now, full disclosure, this was the first time I ever used grommets and I totally did it wrong. So I'm not going to detail exactly what I did since, you know, it wasn't right. I'll link in the description below to two videos that I watched to learn how to install grommets so you can learn from someone who actually knows what they're doing. Then I hung the hammock on the hooks and it was done. I had to train my cat to use it a bit, but now she loves it and it's one of her favorite parts of the tree. If you want more information on the hammock, see the blog post linked in the description below. I've also linked to the cat tree video and post, so you can check those out as well. Thanks and don't forget to hit subscribe.